What's up everyone and welcome or welcome back to my channel Chess Doctor here with yet another banger and in today's video we'll be playing some chess against XQC bot on chess.com so he's rated 1200 I am my highest rating is like 1000 in rapid so do I stand a chance we're gonna see today okay guys so I hope you enjoyed this video if you enjoyed throughout make sure to leave some comments because they really make my day and let's just begin with the video let's start playing some chess uh, and uh, let's hopefully crush XQC I'm very excited to play against this bot I think I tried to play against him a couple of times uh, but uh, it didn't really end, you know, well, okay? But I was lower rated at the time, so maybe today I have some chances, okay? So we're going to start with d4, and now we're just waiting for him to respond. Is he online? I mean, I know XQC is very busy, but what is happening? Okay, so he says, bing, bang, boom, let's do this, okay? So XQC is here with us, and he still didn't make a move. <laughs> is he playing me the soldier boy opening? He's just not responding. Okay, we have the Dutch defense. Something that I really never know how to how to do, what to do against this, okay? So, uh, we're just going to continue with our plans. We're just going to ignore it, okay? Classical variation, okay, okay. So, uh, let's develop here. Uh, and we really would like to push here, so I think we should also develop this horse. Uh, but he do be defending that currently, okay? We still don't care. Because uh, we can do this, this, then this, okay? We're still going to push it up, Don't we don't care, okay? Uh, we can do this and exchange the horse, actually. We can do that as well. And he do be defending it like this, oh, okay. It's already defended, but... And now he takes it to bishop. Okay, so he just can't castle kingside anymore. Okay, XQC, you do be being extra saucy today, okay? So uh, this is defended and now we can go here and if he takes, go here and attack the bishop, which I think is pretty fine. I think that's pretty solid, okay, sir? I think that's pretty okay. And now he do be doing this. So uh, can I push here? Takes, takes. And then, if I mean, he can take because we just snatched this. So I think we can honestly do that. But we can maybe actually better... Take back with the horse. Oh, he j he just gave the bishop. He just he just gave the bishop. Okay, 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 sir. <laughs> I didn't expect him to give the bishop. Okay, I'm very stunned by this. So we're going to go here uh, to keep the bishop on this diagonal. I don't know what his plans are currently because he just randomly gave the bishop. So was it like a brilliant sacrifice? She would be afraid. I mean, he's twelve hundred. You know. You never know. So we're going to castle just to be safe. And uh, he can't castle kingside, so he has to develop his bishop, which is very hard currently. And he's not working on that. He's not working on developing his bishop whatsoever. Uh, okay. So we should we should do something about this. Uh, we can go here, and if he takes, then we take with the, with the tempo on the queen. I mean, we can do that, because we're pretty much developed. I want to develop my queen, but I'm not sure here or here. So I think I sh I'm gonna do this. Or maybe we should put an extra layer here so that later we have a discovery if something like this happens, because he still cannot castle. Okay, but he do be pushing a lot of pawns. He do be pushing a lot of pawns, which is just very weird to me. So we're going to push this pawn, this crucial pawn, okay? We're going to push it up to see what he does. Okay. Okay, so he didn't go according to my plans. Uh, okay, sir. Wait, but he can now take back with the horse. So if we go here, it's not that saucy anymore. It's actually not that saucy anymore. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. Now we do be thinking. I am not sure whether or not we should like sacrifice the horse here. I don't know why, but I really feel the need to. Uh, to just sacrifice the horse there, but then like if he takes here, what do we do? We can go here and then like take this and then keep on winning material like that, but it's actually then equal. We just won one pawn, I think, or two. We won two pawns in that exchange. Also, this is going to be pinned. So I think maybe it's actually okay. I think it's actually okay. I'm gonna try it out. I, I don't know how XQC plays. Uh, but he did take this, okay? 
Because, like, I, I don't know. Okay, so we're going to take this. Because we just snatched two extra pawns and we were already plus two. So, actually one pawn, I guess. Okay. Uh, now, uh, we still can't take this. This is now opened up. Okay, okay. Uh, we should ask the queen a question, but sadly we can't either do that part, okay? I mean, we can give a check here. I don't know what would that do, though. Let's just open up the position, okay? I shouldn't be afraid of trading up pieces with XQC here, uh, because uh, I do be plus material, okay? So I can go here now and uh, try to snatch the bishop, but he can just defend with rook on e on e8. And then what? What do we do then? Maybe we should better uh, double up the rooks. Because we can't at attack the bishop with the horse anyhow. I mean, we can go here and try to fork him. Like this. And then win the bishop with, with something like this. Okay, he doesn't want to get forked. He wants to checkmate me, okay? He really wants to checkmate me. So we have to push this. Now I'm afraid of this coming up, honestly. Because after that, what? We let him take and then we take with an f-pawn and we're good. Yeah, he doesn't have a, a dark square bishop, so... But I do be dark. This picture is always dark to me. I don't know why. Whenever I move my head, it's always dark. It's always dark, okay? So he do be asking my horse a question. Uh, now we can... Um, we can take the pawn with the check, we can do that, or we can just attack the bishop, but then he just moves the bishop, right? Yeah, and he also has a horse defending the bishop, I forgot about this part. I do it plus four, so maybe I'm chilling. We're gonna see, we're gonna see, okay? So now we can do this, and I think that's okay, because then we, uh, we're threatening this horse here. Uh, and we just take the horse. Yeah, we just take the horse. And we just want a horse. Uh, we also can take now this, which is ours. And I think that's pretty much now we're being chilling since we're be like, being like plus 10, okay. Now he probably wants to go here, but I don't know what will that do. And even if he like goes here, still what does that do, sir? <laughs> I don't know, okay? Let's check if we have any saucy forks. We do not. We do not have any saucy forks. I mean, we can take this pawn. We can offer a queen trade and then have to never worry about checkmate, okay? Yeah, we can do that. We can do that. Because honestly, it's better. I'm plus 11. Why would I be afraid of trading up queens, you know? Now he has to struggle. So we're going to go here in order to, you know, cut this line and cut this line. And just probably deliver a checkmate very soon. Yeah, okay. Now I have to think of something. How do I give a checkmate here, sir? So I can go here. And then he just... Okay, wait. I can also... Cut him like this. And then, I don't know. He moves here. And then we go here. And then he, like, moves here. Yeah, that makes no sense. I'm gonna give this check, okay? I'm gonna give it with the horse. I'm not really sure uh, what exactly should I do here. So should I go like, but I don't wanna trade up the, these rooks, okay? Maybe we should actually trade it up. Cause I can't fork him now, I can't fork him. And if I like go here and trade up, then I don't have enough. So we're just going to feast up on the pawns. And uh, then probably after that, trade it up or something. Okay, we can't take this. We have to go like this in order to offer a trade. We have to connect that rooks, okay? Connect, and he wants to, he, he just gave it. He just gave it again. So XQC really doesn't want to play this game anymore. Okay, then we're going to checkmate him, sir, because I, I want to be fair to him. I see that he doesn't want to play it. So we're going to end the game quickly, okay, guys? Here we go. I beat XQC. That feels amazing because I really thought this bot was like unbeatable, but now I see that 1200s are very, very easy. Uh, let's save this to my archive and then uh, check the game review because I'm wondering what were these moves. I mean, I pretty much won the game just because he gave the bishop, gave the horse, gave the everything, you know. Uh, but I'm wondering what's the estimate. Okay, I have a good accuracy, 86.7%. He's also fine with 763 
and I have 14 best moves. Okay, in a in a how many move game? In a, a 32 move game. They're estimating me 1500 guys. Look at this. They're estimating me 1500. So most of you were right. I could be around 14, 1500, right? Maybe even more, you know, you never know. And they're estimating him 1150, which is around his rating. So I think that it's fine, but he kind of underperformed because I know that when I played with him before, he was much stronger, but also I was much, uh, much less strong. You know, now I'm getting stronger with each day. So let's check the game review, okay? We were playing this. This is actually a book move. I was just like, sir, I don't want to play your dash defense. So I'm going to continue with the things I know from Queen's Gambit. I don't care about you pushing F5, okay? Uh, he really, I don't know. He just played this opening. And we were playing good. I traded up here so that I can push this pawn. That was my only politic in this one. Only philosophy that I had was E4. Only thing that I was thinking about. This wasn't the best, but yeah, he just gave the bishop here for no reason. And then after that, it was much easier for me. Here, I wanted to align the rook with the king. Uh, he jumped here. I, I shouldn't have sacked, okay? What should I have done? Okay, just ask the horse the question. Okay. I wanted to sack because I was like, I'm, I'm still winning. Sir, I'm still winning, okay? And now here, okay, this was the best move, of course. Best move, okay. A, okay, best move, winning the horse. Winning the bishop, just winning everything, trading the queens, was that? Oh, that was excellent. Let's see what should we have done instead of trading the queens. Oh, just taking like this with the horse. Okay, I was thinking about either that one or trading the queens. But when I saw that I was like plus 10 or 11, I really couldn't care less. So I was like, okay, yeah, let's trade the queens because I don't want to get accidentally check and mated. And I think that was the right decision in this game. Oh, this is the best move, okay? Now we should have done this. Was there like a mate? Okay, mating too. Okay, I <laughs> yeah, the horse is preventing him from going here. So we just we just go here with the check and the sit. He can not kind of stop that, uh, but that's fine. He just ended up, this is the best move. This is the best move, okay? He had to do it. And then we just deliver a checkmate. Okay, thank you. Thank you, uh, XQC bot for playing with me. <laughs> there, uh, let me read the description of the Elo estimate. I'm wondering what the stockfish wants to say about this game. You really outplayed your opponent in that one. The opening was balanced as it was. Uh, you were cut above your opponent in the middle game. That was true. That was true. I was really just, I was besting at this point. I was bestie besting, you know. I was really, I was really on the run against 1200 bot, okay guys? So I have proved myself to myself and to everybody else that I can actually uh, be at least 1200, but here they're saying 1500. So, you know, only sky's the limit, only sky's the limit, guys. So I really enjoyed playing this XQC bot. I'm not gonna play more because, sir, I won. That's it, that's it in my book, okay? So guys, thank you for stopping by and watching me play uh, in today's game. I hope you liked it and please let me know in the comments down below your thoughts and feelings about today's game and today's video. And um, I don't know what should be today's message. Yeah, sometimes you, you can like go uh, towards stronger opponents and do not be afraid. Just because he has a, a more elo doesn't necessarily mean that I'm going to lose every single game. I can also win, you know, you always stand chances no matter what. So just believe in yourself and uh, one day you will reach your goals, okay guys? Uh, so that is it for the video. Once again, thank you for stopping by and watching it. Uh, if you enjoyed it, make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Come on. If you want to become a grandmaster, you have to be subscribed to Tsapa Tsapeti. That's the rule. Uh, I didn't say it, other people did. So, you know, you have to follow the rules, guys. And uh, yeah, leave some comments. Have a wonderful day. Uh, check out the description if you're interested in Discord, club on chess.com, uh, memberships, donations, and uh, Patreon. Yeah, you can check it all out in the description. And that is it. If you played XQC Bot, let me know in the comments down below how did it go for you? Uh, because I crushed him. I just straight up crushed the dude, okay? So I'm gonna go now uh, and go on about my day. I hope you have a wonderful day, guys. Keep on being smiling and positive. And that's it from your chess doctor. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.